Hey friends and lovely, it's me Bruce Lee. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get any legendary pet you want from just a cracked egg. Now this might sound super crazy, but today, Fred Salami, we're literally going to be doing these. So let's jump around and jump down to the main center so we can get started. Yay, we didn't crash land. All right, to do this egg, we need to head back over to the main Roblox page. And then literally straight away, we want to log straight out. And then we want to make a brand new account. Now, I'm making a new account. You don't have to. You can do it on your main account. But I want to make sure that this hack that I'm doing is going to be completely fair. And the fact that I'm a YouTuber isn't going to skew the pets that I get. I want to do this in the most legit way possible. Also, I'm going to name my Roblox account after one of the most recent commenters on the Presley channel. Oh, honestly, I like this username. Let's copy this and let's change it up a little bit. There we go. That's our new username. You know, master forever. And then straight away, we want to jump into Adopt Me. But I also want to get another account that I've got up on my laptop in the same server. And now, because this hack requires a bit of trading, we need to head over to the trade license area so we can get our trade license and hopefully trade for an ultra rare and legendary today. And we've got our trade license. And now I need to get one cracked egg on this account. A starter egg isn't going to do much. It's got to be a cracked egg. And right now I can get my alt account to grab the cracked egg and then trade my boy. Boom, there we go. And now, Prince Salami, we want to do something called trading from common to legendary. Except we're going to be starting with a cracked egg, which is definitely more rare than like just a cat or a dog. So you want to start by copying and pasting this into the chat, trading cracked egg for uncommon or better. Already, we've got a trade. Let's put this little cracked egg in here and already... Already someone is putting in a Lunar Tiger. This is actually insane. So literally, we just got a Lunar Tiger from a cracked egg. But we can scale this up and up and up to even better and crazier pets. Let's go ahead and confirm this pretzel. I mean, literally the first trade and we've already got it. Now that you've got the Lunar Tiger, you want to change what you're typing. So now we're going to say trading Lunar Tiger for ultra rare or better. And we can see this person's trading some neons. Ooh, this is actually really cool. So maybe they might want to trade KK Beredin two more slots. That person's got a couple of slots. This person has a Kaka bowl. I really don't know what to say to that, but let's just try trade for it. They've put in their ultra rare Kaka bowl. Oh, come on. The first thing I'm doing when I get that pet is I'm changing the name of it. This person put in a ginger cat. All right, this is actually pretty good. Already we've gone from a cracked egg all the way up to a ginger cat. Let's accept this. Come on, please accept. Please don't leave me hanging here. Oh, they said, hope you like it. Yes, TYSM. Already we've done two trades and we've literally gone from a cracked egg to an ultra rare ginger cat. You guys can see how insane this is. Now, don't leave the video. You might be thinking you've got everything sorted out and you're like, oh yeah, he's just gonna trade up to a legendary. But you see, now is the trickiest part because we have a ginger cat but no one's gonna trade a legendary for a ginger cat, let's be honest. What they will trade a legendary for is a couple of ultra rare pets. So once you've got the one cracked egg that's built all the way up and you've worked your way up to getting an ultra rare, or maybe you're still at like a good rare pet, but nobody's really trading for it, you wanna go into this room in the hospital and grab a bunch of healing apples. Then you wanna head back to the main center and you wanna say that you're trading healing apples for a common pet. Now these are actually free items that you don't have to pay any money for, which is awesome. So we're gonna be trading healing apples for anything. Literally at this point, if someone offers you a stick, you accept the stick because healing apples are completely free and you're not losing anything by trading for smaller items. Because if you can get just a bunch of small items, you can slowly build that up. And if you've got 10 small items, you can trade that for a small pet or even like a good pet. So we want to start doing this and see what trades we get. And now I've got a message in the chat saying, trading, healing apples, everything is greatly appreciated. And at this point, you just want to start trading literally everyone. And if they accept your trade, you want to keep on saying the message that you wrote in the little trade chat. And then you can put in some healing apples. And I find that this part takes the longest because they're healing apples and no one's going to trade much. But eventually you'll find a really nice person who wants to trade you good stuff for them. Like this person who's trading an ice cream. You also wanna make sure you accept all of your party invites just because there might be something good where someone's looking for the pet that you're trying to trade. This one isn't, that's just a nice little hotel. But that's what we're doing, Pretzel Army. We're grinding up to try and get a legendary pet from our cracked egg. So far, we've got an ultra rare ginger cat, which is pretty good. 
want to get even better than that. Oh, and literally somebody is trading us a dog for nine healing apples. Two dogs for nine healing apples and a cat. No, this is... Oh my gosh, Pret Salami. We're totally getting there. This is what I'm talking about. Some people will be super duper nice and they'll trade a decent amount of like bad pets for healing apples, which is totally worth it. And okay, Junior post -teen, That's pretty good. Junior, newborn, newborn, preteen. Okay, we'll be able to trade that post -teen dog and that's definitely what we're going to be telling everyone about the post -teen dog. Come on. Really? Who, who was it? Who was it who traded me and then just ditched me last second? Come on. This person put in an ermine and a Shetland pony dark brown for the nine healing apples. Okay, Fred Salami, we're 100% accepting this. I feel like they might leave last second though, like the other person did. But definitely, if you can try and get out of game pets or pets that are limited edition, so in small updates or even big updates like the Christmas one. Oh my gosh, they actually went through. TYSM, let's go. All right, they're definitely like the least rare pets in the whole update, but they're definitely worth something in this trading challenge. So right now we've got an uncommon ermine, a Shetland pony dark brown, a ginger cat, and the rarest item of them all a little ice cream <laughs> Ooh, this person put in a dark brown shetland pony for the ultra rare ginger cat they put in a camel okay 100 percent we're doing we're getting an uncommon camel and a dark brown shetland pony for one ginger cat oh i i think that we're slightly over i don't know pretzelami i'm kind of just doing it to get the extra pet and that way we'll have a slightly larger inventory there we go that's another trade done okay i wonder what pet we're going to get <laughs> An orangutan! That's sick! Hey, TYSM! I don't know who that was, but whoever it was, thank you. That's awesome. What is up with people and giving us the Shetland ponies for the golden apples? Let's go. Okay, we are going to be getting a bunch of Shetland ponies. Honestly, we're getting like an army of them. And I just jumped into a new server because that other server was getting too rich for someone like me to be in. <laughs> and already someone's giving us a free mouse, TYSM. And Fred Salami, let's just go ahead and offer for our first legendary. And it's a Zodiac minion. Let's just offer all of the pets that we've got so far. And of course, the sacred ice cream. <laughs> And then let's also add in a healing apple just for fun. And let's see if this person wants to offer for it. Or ooh, they put in two bread salami. They put in three and they're flexing at this point. They put in four. They're definitely flexing and they decline the trade. Okay, it looks like we've still got to grow our inventory and we've still got to get more and more pets and get richer before someone is going to offer us a legendary. I think if we've got nine under legendary pets, I think that we might be able to start trading up for a couple of ultra rare, like good ultra rare pets, and then up to a legendary. I think that might be our plan. Oh, this person's offering up some soapy skates. They're pretty cool. Let's go. And now this person's trading a little ant. Oh, this person's offering a leopard cat for the healing apples. Okay, once we get this pet, if they accept, hopefully they will. Come on. Yes, they accept it. Okay, now that we've got this pet, I think what the game plan should be is to get some Robux ultra rare pets. Maybe like a couple of slots, a couple of pandas, because we've actually got a good amount of pets. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different pets. And our little ice cream cone, of course. <laughs> and I think that we might be able to use these pets to offer for some ultra rares. I just got a party invite saying that someone's giving away free pets for noobs or new players. And uh, that's definitely us. And that could help in this challenge. And the person who hosted a party is actually here. And apparently we're first in line. All right, let's see if they're scamming or if they're actually giving away free stuff to new players. Yo, a ghost wolf pretzel army? No. All right. Let's go, let's accept. Let's go, Fred Salami, TYSM. Now we've got another pet that will definitely help us. Okay, Fred Salami, I'm just trading random people and I'm putting in all of our best pets that we've gathered so far today. This person put in a Royal Palace Spaniel. This is definitely a full inventory upgrade if they go through with this because it's an ultra rare and an ultra rare there. And then that's three, four ultra rares. I think we've got this pretzel, aren't we? I think 100% we go through with this. Let's go. We may be losing three pets, but it's definitely being made up for in the fact that we're getting four ultra rares in this trade. Don't leave me hanging. Just accept. Come on. Oh, no. Yes. Okay. Phew. I thought they were trolling. For a second, I totally thought they were trolling. But we've literally got a bunch of ultra rares now. Okay. I think we can go in and try trading for any legendary now.
I haven't spent any Robux on this and we haven't grinded for anything. All of it has been trading from free items or from our super awesome crack deck we started the challenge off with. Wait, this person offered a gold horn? There is no way that we get a gold horn, Brett Salami. Literally, we started off from a crack deck. We're gonna get a gold horn? Oh, Brett Salami, they accepted the trade. Okay, there is no way. We're about to get a gold horn starting from a crack deck. Literally, there has been no Robux spent on this account, and we're getting a legendary literally day one. Okay, it's actually this easy to get rich in Adomi. Fred Salami, legit, if your dream bet's a gold horn, you could literally get it in just a day. Let's go! We started from a crack deck, and we have worked our way all the way up to a gold horn. Now, really, you can choose what pet you get in the end. I didn't have to accept the gold horn. I could have kept on grinding and gotten even better pets. I don't even have to stop now. I could get more cracked eggs or more healing apples, restart the challenge from scratch, but then also have the gold horn there, get multiple legendaries, and then trade for like a neon or mega neon. I can keep on going with this. So really, you can choose whatever legendary you want to get from the crack deck at the beginning that you started building from. I'll see you in the next one. Have the best day ever. Peace.